I think it's about, again, for me, trying to get the message out most clearly to the reader. So when I'm revising, I try to keep that in mind as I'm going through. Um, look at things that might be potentially confusing, look at things where I haven't made clear references, look at places where there are transitions or links that need to may be made back to other places that will help to build the flow of the paper. What do I need to do to this to make it clearer for the reader what I'm trying to say? I'm ready to start revising once I finish the last sentence of the conclusion. Because once again, I don't pay attention to quality very much when I'm writing my first draft. So I consider everything after the first draft revision process. Taking a break is really helpful. So when you're revising, uh, making sure that you put some distance in between yourself and this thing that you've been working really hard on for the last however long, week or maybe months, if it's your dissertation or a thesis, um, taking a little break to go back with fresh eyes and also asking other people to read it. So that always helps to get a diversity of opinions and also just get that audience point of view and see whether or not what you want to say is coming across in the clearest and simplest way possible. I start my revision process often very early, um, often even before I've written an entire document. So I'll take an early section in the paper and revise that and get the structure really well honed and then I have something really strong to work from when I'm going through the further sections. So I try to use a variety of different tools for uh, revising my writing. So that would be things like using a printout version, um, using on screen, and then also changing up the pace of my revision. So that sometimes I'm really honing in on one section and other times I'll be going through quickly for grammar or going through quickly for structure.